Hi guys, I'm Katie Jane Hughes and I'm here with Millie and we're gonna do a flushed blush look. So yesterday on set we used the Laura Mercier brand new ones, they're gorgeous. Today I'm gonna try the Kevin Aquan Grapevine Neo Blush. I'm gonna start kind of here, over here, tap off the excess and then turn to me a tiny bit, there you go. And then you can like buff the lightest shade into the apple of the cheek and take it kind of into a wider space. You can use that brighter one to almost cool it down if you put too much, it's really, really, really smart. Turn the other side, and then here. Let me see you. And with my fingertip, I'm just gonna take over the top a little bit. Then with the very, very tip of that brush, I'm gonna take it into the richest part of the color. Take it onto the palm of my hand just to make sure there's not too much on. Smile a tiny bit. I'm just gonna have a really smile. I'm just gonna pop it on the apple of the cheek so that we get like a natural color. It's like kind of unnatural to use one shade of blush in my opinion. It should be like a little bit of two or you know, it should be layered very slowly and softly in a larger space and then concentrated color in one part of the face. Because that way it looks the most sort of real. I'm gonna pop a little bit over the lip. I'm using the same brush just because I don't want it to look like I've done it. I want it to just look like it's her lip color. And then I'm gonna take a large eyeshadow brush. Close your eyes. I'm just gonna press that right over the lid to sort of connect it. It's like pretty when there's a story and it's like there's, you know, it's not just in one place. Like I said, it's cool to take it elsewhere. Do you ever do blush on your eyelids? I haven't really experimented with that, but yeah. definitely will. It's really fun, it's just another way of playing with it and then I can take that lighter shade, mm -hmm. pop it in the center of the lid, just to almost open it up, add a brightness. And then with that big brush again, I'm just gonna take the lightest shade and just take it over the cheek. So now what I love to do is take my titty moisturizer, put it over my hands, press them together and then just roll it over the top. And what that does is it gives it just like a really dewy effect. It'll also just knock it back by like 5%. And that's such a good tip. Done. Wow, I love it.